Oh, that sounds fun. Okay, that sounds so like a good time. It was really nerdy. First of all, following, it says, on this, according to this website, and this is from US Citizenship's, uh, uscitizenshiptestguide.com. So they might know a couple things about it. Okay? It says, these are the five toughest questions. You guys will take turns being the initial respondent so that there's no... Uh, you know, <laughs> I have a feeling this is going to be embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm I, nervous. I really, really hope so. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so I'm just going to tell you guys, I already took the test, okay, and I got 100%. So I knew all, every single freaking question. Okay. Or so okay. you say. I say. You can take this from me later. We'll do it after <laughs> the show. It'll take too long because it's 100 questions long. Oh. I would be perfectly willing to take this in your presence. 100 questions. Okay. I actually thought it was really freaking easy. I'm like, people have to study for this? I thought you just like absorbed it. I thought you just knew it from breathing from the culture. air. From culture. Okay, what are yeah. the five hardest? Okay. What did the Emancipation Proclamation do, Adam? <laughs> it freed the slaves. Strauss. It freed the slaves. It did very good. <laughs> Wait, that's hard. Wait a minute. That's one of the five. <laughs> okay, go Excuse ahead. Excuse me. Sorry. Excuse sorry, me. sorry. Name one of the American Indian tribes. Strauss. The Sioux. Apache? Spell Sioux. <laughs> S O I U X. Dead gummit. Adam. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not spelling a patch. A P A C H E. It's actually really easy. Yeah. But, it's exactly but you can't spell sounds. anything. I probably so. have a little help. Uh, there's a lot of places in Iowa called it like Sioux Falls, Sioux City, Sioux Center. That's right. Very and we good. live in Arizona. But I did, did I get it right? Uh, you did. Okay. Here. Uh, Adam, name one of the three, and you cannot take his. You can't take his. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Name one of the three authors of the Federalist Papers. The Federalist Papers? Mm -hmm. Ooh, that's a good question. Ooh. Ooh. James Madison? Ooh, you got one. Good job. I got the easiest one. <laughs> you, the... You, not really. You actually named second place. Oh, yeah? Yeah, as far as amount that they wrote. Right. But he's, he's kind of a big name. Mm -hmm. Cause Cause he, is, he was a president. The other one wasn't a president. I tossed out a hint, but... I don't know if Strons would bite on that or not. Uh, he was personal secretary to George Washington during the American Revolution. I said James Madison. Oh. He Which was is a, partly a, a guess, but I, I wasn't listening to what involved. your clue was. What was your clue? It wouldn't help you anyway. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm ha tossing out all kinds of facts about him. That Hamilton was anti-federalist. Hamilton was not an anti-federalist. Then it was him. It was Hamilton. Very nice. good. Third author. Save anybody. It. Happened to be the first Supreme Court uh, Chief Justice. His name was John Jay. Oh, yeah. John Jay. John Jay only wrote five. He got, he, uh, got stricken ill and told Madison and Hamilton, sorry, guys, but you're on your own. I'm really sick. Um, what is Susan B. Anthony famous for? And yes, it's a very general answer. Being awesome. Is that general? No. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, who's first? Oh, Strong's is first. Uh, just uh, women's rights. Adam? <laughs> <laughs> <He just laughs> uh, sure. Women's rights. Yeah. yeah. That's oh, the women's rights movement. Yeah. Very good. And 20s, you guys, right? by the way, are doing this without multiple choice, which they get. Oh, oh so. see, that would have been... Really, cause <laughs> oh, no, you know what? Some of them are writing answers. Oh, okay. are they? Okay. Yeah, Fair some enough. of them are writing. It's a mix. Okay, so... Um, who is the current Chief Justice of the U.S. Supreme Court? Chief Justice? Chief Justice. It's Roberts? Am I wrong on that? Strons? Oh, good God. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I, you just hear all of them. Uh, Do you hear all of them? Because I only heard one. <laughs> <laughs> I said Roberts. Uh, I knew the answer. Justice Roberts. Uh, because he is it a, it's a man or a woman. <laughs> it is. It is a man or a woman. It absolutely is a man or a woman. And it's a woman. Yeah, he's not going to receive. Is it? Anything. Is it the first Latina Supreme oh, Court Chief uh, Justice? So Sonia Mayor. Soda. Ah, very bad. No, I tricked you. It is not the first Latina. <laughs> he had it right. It was yeah. John Roberts. <laughs> well, so there's the only reason Scali why I know that. Is Scalia still on there? Uh, Scalia is still yeah. on there. Yeah. But Robert, it, like when they ever, whenever they talk about a 
decision. Mm -hmm. They usually say, well, Roberts wrote because Mm -hmm. he comes out with, you know, whether or not. I don't know how. You hear hear about him. He's one of the main authors. After the Obamacare decision, I don't know how anybody can forget Chief Justice John Because he was the decider. It is infamous now to me. Okay. I'm like, yes, he can rot a slow death and and die a thousand times. I was going to say Thurgood Marshall. (laughs) He was. He was. was. At one point. Very good. And I already gave you one John Jay. He was the first. (laughs) Very good. Well, you know what, you guys? You did pretty good on the five hardest. You didn't even get multiple choice. Now, how about just a couple easy ones, and then we can kind of move on to sure. the other topic. Okay. What, <laughs> I, I swear I'll slap you both if you don't get it. Strons, what is the supreme law of the land? <laughs> <laughs> the Bible. The, <laughs> <laughs> that better be one in the multiple choice. <laughs> no, uh, the multiple choice are Mom, Apple Pie, Chevrolet, the Constitution. Are you serious? No. Okay. <laughs> I believed you. Mom, Apple Pie. <laughs> I actually, for my citizenship really in the nation merit badge, our, Scouting, yeah. back in Scouts, our, our uh, merit badge counselor gave us a written test, and those were the, the uh, answers for one of them. It was Mom, Apple Pie, Chevrolet. Um, oh, and it was named the three branches of government, and that was one of the selected. Mom, uh, Apple Pie, Chevrolet, and then it was, you know. Oh, speaking of. What are the three branches of government, Adam? Should we each say one? And I'll start. Judicial. Okay. Executive. Legislative. Le- there you go. Okay, now here's a fun one. Okay, last one, last one, last one. Okay? Because you need to understand how ridiculous this is. And we should go over it. We should do a man on the street video because this one would be awesome. Which branch has the legislative powers? <laughs> No joke. <laughs> um, definitely the executive branch. Correct. <laughs> Strong. Uh, that'd be the tentative branch. <laughs> <laughs> the right. answer's in the question, and people probably still get it wrong. I, we got to go ask people on the street. Yeah. We've got... Uh, do you, how many people would go, oh... <laughs> yeah, I just, mm. I'm telling you, people well, don't know what's that. What's funny is most people, when you're like, what are the branches of government, they usually say... The president, the Congress, and the Supreme Court. They don't know the names of them. Right. Yeah. President, Congress, or they'll say the House of Representatives, the Senate, Mm -hmm. and and then the president. And the president. (laughs) And you're like, okay. 